Good morning from Ocean K. Now, you got your breakfast? Yeah. Eat, eat. Is it good? You gotta eat. So when you come in and to the right, there is a rental and excursion pavilion. And uh, I'm assuming you can, I'm gonna see if I can rent a, um, uh, some umbrellas from here. But um, I'm assuming you can rent water equipment and any other, and then of course the excursions if you want a last minute excursion here. But it is absolutely beautiful. This is my color. This is the MSC shop, y'all. All things MSC. Y'all, Jackson big chilling on the beach. He got his own little personal fan. He under the stroller. He got his umbrella. He big chilling. So this is the family cove. You can see that they built this. This was man-made and it's enclosed off so it's not very deep. It's huge, but it's not deep to be family friendly. And it is beautiful. Ugh. Y'all having fun? Why not? A oh boy, we'll get in the water again soon. Janelle? You having fun? Stop throwing the sand, dudes. <laughs> splash, 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 splash. Jesse. You have fun? Yeah. Ooh. Yeah. Boogie, you having fun? Yeah. All right. I want to see huh? I want to see she gone. We're going to send her a video, okay? Chill, chill on, chill on. Jackson having fun. He in the ocean for the first time. Yay! Water? Sunscreen? Do, 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 do. I just put sunscreen on before I came outside. Oh, okay. Say hi! Say hi! This one is living his best life. First time in the ocean. So we're at the food truck, which is right by the family beach, and they have burgers, hot dogs, pasta salad, french fries, and brownies. And apparently they never change the, the sign, because we're not on Seascape, we're on Seaside. But they have two of these. There's one right here, and there's one over here. We had a wonderful day at Ocean K. Lots of sun, lots of water, lots of sand good food good drinks but now we're headed back because sun and little ones equal crankiness so we are docked here until um tomorrow at 12 noon so i doubt it very seriously if we get off tomorrow just because the time is so short uh, everyone has to be back on board tonight by 11:30, and then, um, and then uh, tomorrow you can get back off at 8 o'clock, back on board by 11:30. So, doubt it if we'll get off again tomorrow. <clears throat> but the plan is to get off tonight after we shower and relax a little bit, because there is a light show. Uh, and dancing and entertainment tonight. So I'm hoping, fingers crossed, uh, Deuce will go to 
the kids club Jackson's not too much of a hassle because he's in a stroller uh, and then I'm hoping fingers crossed that the grandparents will keep Janelle so that we can come back out and enjoy a little bit of the nightlife on the island so I'm not sure if you get a good view of it let me see so we're told this is the housing where the staff lives and the gentleman told us that uh, five days a week they have a ship that docks here uh, they only get one off day uh, that sixth day that there's no ships here they're still working to clean and uh, do all of the greenery and gardening and all of that stuff um, so yeah they only get one off day here crazy also here is a coffee and ice cream place there is a charge for this there is a, I don't know if you can see it but there's a cost associated with it and you can get all the toppings and then there's also coffee both hot and ice but I don't understand why in this type of weather that you would want hot coffee, but to each his own. And then right here, not far after you get off the ship is Springer's Bar. Plenty of bar options, I will say that. And if I'm not mistaken, I think this is the bar that Phil and Dee were at when they were here. Shout out to Phil and Dee Travel Spree. I also want to make mention that there are plenty of restaurants throughout uh, the island and they are very clean and immaculate. Every time you look up there, staff somewhere, uh, cleaning them up and making sure that they are nice and pristine. And they also have showers on the side, so full showers. Uh, and then also showers where you can, you know, rinse off all your sand and crevices and stuff. They have a Bahama shop, which is uh, just Bahama gear, not necessarily pertaining to Ocean K. And they have the Ocean K shop with nothing but Ocean K wear. So it's a really nice island, very nice.
is what Ocean K looks like at night. Very nice. They got lights on all of the palm trees. Well lit, because I was wondering, I'm like, uh, how dark is it gonna be out here? But it's very nice. Wonderful breeze compared to earlier this morning. So yeah, this is a really nice place. Y'all don't know if y'all can see it. The camera got Bud Light next to the diaper bag. What kind of parents are we? Great parents. <laughs>
very, very nice light show. Uh, right now, it is like 10.45. I am about to head to go pick up Jackson, Jackson to pick up Deuce from Kids Club. I don't know if I've mentioned it in a previous vlog, but the elevators are similar to um, the newer ships on Carnival, uh, where you use the keypad, you press what um, floor you're going to, and then it will tell you what elevator. Is this ten? Yes, this is ten. Yes. Perfect. And then it'll tell you. Um, what elevator that you need to catch to get to that floor. For the most part, it is um, real efficient, but at times it can be annoying because they will send you an elevator that is completely full of people, and then you've been sitting there waiting all that time thinking, okay, my elevator's on the way, my elevator's on the way. And then uh, you get there, and then um, it's completely full. Yeah, all of the clubs are together. Baby club is down there for zero to three. Mini club is three to six. And then you got the junior club, which is seven to 11. And then young club, 12 to 14. And teen, 15 to 17. And they're all in the same area. 